Don't just hate it when you hit a really sick clip in your game. You press record and then when you play it back, you've got YouTube playing in the background. You've got your friends talking in the background. You're thinking, shit, how do I make it so I can't hear them? I'm going to show you how to do it. Stick around. Right, are you ready? We're going to need OBS. Just plain old OBS. No stream labs, no stream elements. The bloatware, it's confusing to use. Half of the stuff doesn't fucking work for me, personally. I like to have control of everything. And with OBS, it lets you do that. So, to get OBS, you're going to have to go to this website here. Open obsproject.com. There will be a link to this in the description. Or you can Google it if you don't trust me. So, you download OBS for Windows. You install it. And then you also need virtual audio cable. So you go to this website here, vb-audio.com slash cable with a capital C for some reason. I don't know. Link will be in the description anyway, so don't get confused. And then you download for Windows again. And you're going to need a second thing. This is where you might have to set sail and become a pirate. Because to get A and B and C and D, which is four more audio cables, which you do need for this. You can donate to download and the licensing price is five euros 10 euros i don't understand i didn't pay for it i did pay for it i'm not a pirate to get it for free just look on their website right here it tells you the name of the file that you're about to download very stupid of them you can search this on google for this file and find a trusted file host and website to download it from or you could probably download it off some people on youtube that actually share the links I'm not doing that. I don't want to get shut down. But my knowledge is free. I can say what I want, right? To get this for free, Google it. This file right here. Same for this one over here. The package name. Search for this. You will find it on the internet. So once you've installed them all, you're going to need to restart your computer. Wait, I don't know if you need to. I highly recommend you do, though. But save this video first. Put it in your watch later or add a bookmark. Come back to it once you've restarted the computer and continue watching. So now you've installed everything. Hopefully you've restarted your computer and you're back. Welcome back. If not, you're, you're, you're brave. I don't like installing stuff and not restarting. I like to restart to make sure everything works perfectly. Anyway, I'm rambling. So once you're in your OBS, it will not look like this. This is my OBS with the infinite tunnel going down into the abyss. I can't see what's down there, can you? Anyway, you, have your, you won't have any of this stuff here. I can't really change this because this is what I'm recording with right now. I tried it a minute ago. I made a video. I changed it and I lost all audio, so I'm not doing that again. Let's help you set this up with Spotify, for example, so you can separate that, all that stuff. So you're going to need to go to your sound settings. You can hit the Windows key and go to sound, type in sound settings, and scroll to the very bottom, and it's under the advanced tab. It's called more sound settings. You click on here, and you'll be presented with this window. You've got your playback devices, your recording devices, your comms, and all this stuff. We're only messing with these two tabs right here. So you want to scroll down until you can see these colorful icons. I've named mine specifically so I don't get confused. But you have the same, like, the this this recording is basically like the the output. Or the it's just treat it like a, an audio jack going into your computer. So all your sound devices go into this one. And they come out through this one. So this is where you hear it. So of all of these, you do need to right click them. Go to properties. And go to listen and check this listen tab this button right here go to default playback device and make sure it's on default playback device my i got lost there for a second you don't want it set to any specific device like your headphones or anything like this because you have to change it for every single one every time you change it your audio output so if you've got two setups like your i got my speakers my soundbar and my headphones so i set the default device on all of these so i can simply just change it here so headphones and speakers. So, so anyway, you do have all of these. You rename them. So for the red one, I've named it Web Browser. And as you can see, on playback and recording, I've named them both so I don't get confused. And my Discord's are on the default one. So for Discord, for example, make sure you've got Listen set. It is set correctly. And then in your Discord, your output device, you want to set it to the one you've just named discord i'm hoping you named it discord named it whatever communications anything like that so here we go we've got my discord and now you should in theory be able to hear it out your headphones still i'm not going to join in the voice chats or anything like that but 
you can hear this now and it's a separate audio track and let's do it with spotify because i haven't fully set up spotify yet on my um obs so my spotify is a green one so it's easier listen is set to listen so i should be able to hear this and playback i've named it spotify as well so let's open spotify and then turn this volume down because that's way too loud if i right click on my sound my my speaker down in the bottom right corner go to open volume mixer this is where all the magic happens so my spotify which is here why is why is it red like this have i got to play a sound first yeah there we go spotify music i click on this and i've got all the audio cables here i've got spotify this is the one i want so i click i've done that to that for my web browser which is not on there but my discord that's set inside of discord let's just say steam is your game you go into that like you go into your valorant your call of duty your whatever and set the output device to be your game sound audio cable which is this blue one for me so you do that of all your your all your software that plays sounds you you specify a specific one for it so i've got cable d that's empty i could use that in the future or just leave it there sitting there probably will i don't listen to that many sounds at once because i confuse the fuck out of me so once all that's set let's get back into your obs i'm going to add spotify to this uh, mix up here so in your sources by the way your your window for this will probably be at the bottom my apologies i changed it this way because it's easier to look up than it is to look down for me so i right click in the sources tab add you want to go to audio output capture name this one spotify or discord or game sound or anything like this click ok on the next tab you'll get to select the device so i select spotify because that's the one i'm using i click ok now i have spotify in the mix up here so if i hit play on spotify real quick you'll see that spotify is playing yeah spotify is playing music so i can pause that i want to now to separate these in your recordings this is the fun part you right click anywhere inside your audio mixer you can do it on the three dots if you want if that helps you click audio advanced audio properties and then in here you'll have all these tracks over here selected so for example this is the one i just put in spotify so all the tracks are selected you don't want this the only time you want to select all your tracks is on track one this is your main default output so when you like open your your clip up in vlc or media player or anything like this it will play all the sounds that you heard through your headphones so for all your track ones keep them selected on all your devices I don't know why webcams in there that, that microphone is terrible but anyway so you've done that so then track two I've got this set for my game sound only oh, Spotify is still select let me just unselect Spotify for all these real quick so you go down your list now track two what do you want that to be do you want it to be your game sound which I've got so you find your game sound device and only select that one let me scroll down make sure it's only that one that's correct and then track three that's going to be my microphone so my mic and aux here that's the only one that's selected on track three track four is my discord it's not selected anywhere else that's perfect track five is my web browser and i'm going to put spotify on track six so in case i wanted to just extract just the audio for some weird reason i don't know so that's all set so now if i how can i do this i'm gonna to have to make another video real quick all right so i've got a sample file right here no not main video this one ear rape i'll drag it in and if i play it up here yeah, look tracks. at it that much either before right, okay this is just a, 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 a lot of rape of music playing. I got like, so as you can hear there's a lot of sound going on there but if i drag this into my um thing down here you can see i've got all these different channels now i'm gonna zoom in on them this one's dead there's nothing on that one so is this one this is all audios together so if i solo this and play it Before. okay this you can see it's a lot of sound going on in the background this one is track three which is should be my microphone all right okay this is just a this is ear rape i've got music so, playing i've got linus tech tips playing so there's that there's my uh music i believe this one no not mute i want to solo this one well we bought something useful so it's my uh 
as you can see, this is my um. I didn't think they were actually gonna accept the offer. So there's YouTube playing there as well. Let's uh, there should be a music one somewhere down here. Track six, I believe it is this one. Solo this. Tell me this, Jake. Is it even oh, possible? So. So that is how you separate all the audio tracks. Like it's very, very good. So let's just say I didn't want the music playing. Well, I wanted just the music playing and I don't want to hear Linus Tech Tips, which is my web browser. So I believe that was this track, Audio 5. If I mute this one. Oh, I didn't. I need to uh, unsolo this. And I need to mute the main one as well because this is all the tracks together. So now. All right, okay, this is just a. You can obviously that's very loud. I'll lower the volume on that one a bit. Okay, this is just a. This is Ear Rape. I got music playing. I got Linus Tech Tips playing. And I got. So there's a video without Linus Tech Tips playing. So, right. So that's it, guys. That's that's how I separate my audio tracks. Oh, I didn't show you how to record. Let me do that real quick. So let me take my webcam back off. So what I do, is I go to my settings on OBS. I go to my output on my recording settings. I've got this this set as this. You can copy. You can set your own recording settings as you wish. Go to your replay buffer in the top right and enable it. I've got mine set for 30 seconds. And then in my hotkeys, you scroll down. You have this replay buffer, save replay buffer, which is my number pad plus. So then when you're playing your game, let me close this a minute. You can hit start replay buffer. And that's like having your shadow play or your whatever the hell AMD used to record the clips. You just press one button and it saves them last 30 seconds in whatever format you've set in OBS. And it will separate that. It won't separate all them audio tracks. My apologies. Another set I need to show you. So you go to your video. No, your output, sorry. Then your recordings. You see on here, it's grayed out because I'm recording right now, but your audio tracks, you want to select all the ones that you're using. And also with your audio, you can name name them. So when I play a video inside of VLC, for example, I can right click audio, audio track. I've got my all my game sounds, my microphone. So I can solo them in here. And obviously, for example, track six is a perfect example to show you. Like, so my track six. I can't show you because I'm recording, but you go through here and you, you name, you put a name on your audio tracks to help you identify them easier. So I think, I think I've covered everything. If you do need any more help, please do join my discord or I prefer if you comment on my YouTube video because it helps my YouTube channel grow. Only join my discord if you really desperately need my help and I'm not responding fast enough in the comments. If you haven't commented on my YouTube video and you ask me in discord, I'll be very disappointed in you. Don't do it. Leave a comment if you need my help. I shall respond as soon as I possibly can. I literally just sit there on my phone. YouTube studio. Just waiting for that one person in the world to comment on my video. So I'm gonna be like, <laughs> I can respond. So please do like, comment and subscribe. I'll see you in the next video, guys. Peace out.